sneak peek at some work I've been um, doing recently on uh, gamification. This project's called Stellar Evolver and um, it aims to teach players um, the basics of stellar evolution from small stars up to you know, giants, um, neutron stars to even to black holes. And it's fully VR ready. Um, you can don a VR headset um, and you can hurl mass. So this demonstration I'm having to use some mouse controls which is a little bit awkward. It works much more naturally in a, a virtual reality setting. As the player throws mass into the system, he can watch he or she can watch the evolution. We have a neutron star forming. In reality, a neutron star is a tiny object, but here we have to caricature everything to make it playable. And there are a couple of neutron stars. You can just see the polar jets from the neutron stars there. I need to work on these special effects very early days. Now we have a, a binary pair of neutron stars. Let's see if we can form a black hole. My intention is to demonstrate a working prototype of this at the next Hebridean Dark Sky Festival, uh, which will be multiplayer. Um, people will be able to compete to develop their star systems. And now the black hole, um, as its name suggests, not visible. Um, its um, existence um, inferred by the behaviour of the other stars and objects in the system. Then you can grow these black holes and their radii will increase. Again, not realistically, uh, a black hole formed from um, even reasonably large stars is a tiny object. If you made a black hole from the moon, for example, it would have a radius of about 0.2 millimetres. Um, you see this black hole dominating now. Anyway, that's a, a quick look at this project. And again, um, gamification is this idea that you can teach um, and impart quite complicated behaviour um, and learning um, through games. And I think it's a great way. Um, to get people involved and interested in science and other areas of research. Thanks for listening.